having a quick swim. It's very nice here today at Coffs Harbour I am. The water's a little cold but it's still very nice. I'm just south of the marina. The marina is back there. Over there. And, uh, it's a little windy today but it's still nice. Big long jetty behind me. So I'm going to finish my swim and then cook some breakfast somewhere and then keep driving. This is very, very nice. So I've just stopped in a truck stop. I'm about an hour south of Ballina in New South Wales. What's this hat doing? Cooking myself some lamb in the truck stop. Some lamb, some eggs, some steak, some um, liver. That's about it. Some bacon. It's with this hat. Where's the front? Feels like the strings are all over the shop. So yeah, so got about 200 k's today. Well, I'm trying to do 500 k's a day to get where I'm heading up north. So I've got about another three hours to go. I'm going to stop in Ballina, go to the gym, and um, yeah. Anyway, I'll keep cooking, cooking and waiting. Turn my steak in 10 seconds. So this is my finished meal. So as I said before, it's egg, onion, lamb, I had red meat yesterday so it's lamb today, pork, some tomatoes, liver, mushroom. I've been reading the book and listening to the podcasts of, let me find the guy, he talks about an all meat diet. And it's absolutely fascinating. Let me just find his name. It's hard to get. Oops. It's hard to get your head around because for so long you've eaten fruit and vegetables and stuff like that. But this guy is fascinating, Dr. Paul Saladino. So he's about what do they call it? Carnivore, carnivore diet, so only meat and organs and uh, heart and all that stuff. So, I'm trying to get my head around that, but I've still included a little bit of fruit and veggies just because it's a new thing for me. But anyway, that's my meal. That whole thing plus an avocado. I had an avocado and a banana, and that is my whole day's food. So I also don't eat breakfast. I don't have to because when you get enough fat and meat and nutrients you're not hungry every and very low carbs you're not hungry every two hours or three hours. So I can easily go have a meal late in the afternoon or late at night and go all the way to lunchtime with no problem. So that's what I've been doing lately. But that's it. I'm going to eat it now, then head down there, I'm back on the road, pack up my stuff. I pack it up, I put it in the bucket, I've got a special, special um, dirty dishes bucket, and then when I go to the gym, I put the bucket in my bag, go into the gym, have a workout, have a shower, wash the dishes in the bathroom with their hot water and sweet, do that every day, no problem really bit of a pain but it's better than nothing see you in the next video if you like the video hit subscribe hit the like button that way you'll get notified to all my new videos as I upload them and I'll, I'll see you in the next video